Back in 2006, the Roloffs began to showcase their journey on Little People Big World. It has now become the longest running show. While most of the kids have quit LPB Dove, Matt and Amy are still very significant to it. They are also attached to their 100-acre Roloff farms. At first, Jacob and Zach had the desire to buy land there and live. But Jacob ended up being the ultimate heir to the farm. Although he didn't buy his way into it, his passion and dedication to maintaining the family property worked in his favor. Apart from looking after the farm, Jacob also does his fair share of farming. Jacob Roloff shows off his plantation. Is he growing WPS on Roloff Farms? In the past few seasons of LPBW, Zach and Jeremy have been upfront about living on Roloff Farms and carrying on the family legacy. But Matt thought they were incompetent and instead let his youngest son, Jacob, take on the farm. While he didn't buy a part of it, he lives there with his family, takes care of the land, and works there. While showing off some plantations in a new Instagram story, viewers realized something. Well, Jacob casually said that all sorts of legal crops grow on the 100-acre farmland. While tons were impressed, others were against it. Some tried to take a dig at Jacob and wondered how TLC felt about such a thing happening in Roloff Farms. Well, LPB Do viewers defended him by saying how the star has nothing to do with the show or the network since he announced his dark past involving CSI and called out one of the producers. So it shut down the naysayers. Has Matt officially made Jacob the heir of the farm? Matt has talked about retiring on his social media posts after hitting 60. The LPB Do star was hoping kids would carry on the legacy, but most of them were against him. His unwillingness to leave the farm to them soured their bond. So Jeremy and Zach moved on. While Jacob used to live on the farm in an RV, his father allotted them his home as he would move into his and Karen's dream house. While Jacob always said he never wanted to buy the farm and didn't have the money to afford it. Yet he has been working there as Matt hired him to do so. But the patriarch looks very assured after letting Jacob take over. While nothing has been official yet, but fans still say it is Jacob and his family that won at last. On Little People, Big World, Zach Roloff had to win the approval of Tori's father after the couple began dating in 2010. They got together while Tori was working on the Roloff pumpkin farm, and they have been together ever since. They'll celebrate their ninth anniversary this upcoming July. The couple dated for three years before Zach proposed to Tori in April 2014 and were officially married 10 months later, in July 2015. The newlyweds began starting a family shortly afterward and have since had three children together named Jackson, Leela, and Joja. Zach began a podcast with his wife, Tori Roloff, after the two made a personal decision to leave the reality show that skyrocketed Zach and the rest of his family to stardom. Although Little People, Big World has been considered one of the best reality TV shows available right now, Zach and Tori have been making the name for themselves outside the show's parameters and restrictions. This career shift aligned well with their family's overall redirection, having relocated to Washington, and more importantly, away from the rest of the Roloff family located in Oregon. On their podcast Raising Heights with Zach and Tori, the happily married couple recently released an episode called The Truth Behind Mixed Height Dating, where Tori recalls getting ready to go on her first date with Zach. She showed him a picture of her father, to which he immediately reacted negatively. He told Tori that Zach was not the guy he pictured for her, but he was able to overlook their height difference after meeting Zach and getting to know him more. Tori says that her entire family now likes Zach more than they like her. Zach explains in the podcast that after attending a private Christian school in Oregon for 12 years, he adjusted to the six-inch rule, which states that two people of opposing genders must sit six inches apart from one another. He also attributes his PDA aversion to his height, claiming he had gotten used to having his own personal space. Zach still gets nervous when Tori tries to hold his hand in public, and in the beginning of their relationship, Tori was hurt by his need for space in comparison to her friends. However, he likes it now. People questioned Tori's motives. Before Zach and Tori left the show, people questioned why Tori was with Zach 
accusing her of perhaps having shallow intentions, clout chasing, for example, and an out-of-control ego like Karen Chandler's. Tori dealt with speculation that she was only interested in Zach due to his success on Little People, Big World. Luckily, Zach's positive relationship with Tori's family gives the duo an emotional support system.